Platform uh, is a great tool, but what if you need to call MySQL Storage Procedure from your app? Is it possible? Now it's possible. Let me show you how to set up it very fast with API flow. So we create a new project with MySQL and connect our database and select storage procedure we need to call and select some tables just for example. We also can select operations we want to use and our storage procedures. Then we publish our project and now we can download open API definition. Then to connect it, we go to API calls and just, download, uh, just upload open API definition we received from API form. So now we have API generated for our MySQL database and we need to add an authorization folder for to enhance on our security. And we can see that all operations we selected is available here and our MySQL procedure is generated and available as API in our Flutter flow project. So now we can create variables to use with this storage procedure. For example, to do ID, I will use number and I suppose it's status to send to our storage procedure. Our storage procedure is very simple. It updates a status of some to-do item found by ID. So now we have these variables and we insert them into our JSON body. Just drag this field where you need it, like here, and here. And we are set with our data. Body. So now we can test it, go for example and update status of to do with ID 2 to new and we send test API call. And as you can see, it's successful and return us status new. It's how you can connect your MySQL storage procedure to be called from Flutterfall. I will drop a link in uh, in description to this video to our website. Go and test it yourself. Have a nice day.